Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. In this portion, we are going to have discussion about Kingdom Protista or important MCQs related to it. So let's move to the question number one. One of the following is not a feature of any protest. So cell, they have cellular organization. Some of them they are having autotrophic nature, as well as some of them they are having absorptive nature. But embryo formation is not at all a characteristic of protists. That's why they're classified separately in Kingdom Protista. So Charlie is the right option. One of the following does not possess mitochondria. It's giant amoeba that possesses multiple nuclei, but none of uh, none of other any membrane bounded organelle. Which of the following is a symbiotic zooflagellate? It is trichonympha, which lives in the guts of termite and helps in digestion of wood. The protist that reproduces uh, show binary fission and conjugation. They are paramecium. And a polyploid macronucleus will be found in a ciliate that is vorticella. It is having a large polyploid macronucleus and multiple smaller micronuclei. A model used for the study of cytoplasmic processes is Physarum. Polycephalum. The cell walls from form two thin overlapping shells in which group of organisms such uh, that they fit together. It is chrysophyta or diatoms. They have a the red tide is caused by it's caused by dinoflagellates or pyrophyta, which usually color the uh, sea sea water as red, orange, or brown. And that is called red tide. <clears throat> Golden brown algae, they are also known as chrysophytes or diatoms. And most diverse group of algae is known as the group of chlorophyta. The largest of all protists, they are found in brown algae or pheophyta, which are also known as kelps, having the largest size in case of algae as well as protists. Which kingdom? incorporates phytoplanktons and zooplanktons it's protista as well as animalia so out of given option protista is the better answer which is most likely the ancestor of animals it is conoflagellate due to presence of collar cells they are considered as ancestor of sponges determine which feature of the conoflagellate was likely the most significant for the evolution of animals it was Flagellum with a funnel shaped contractile collar cell also found in sponges. So, which group of protists most closely resemble with green plants? It is green algae, which is having multiple features resembling to that of green plants. And all are correct about brown algae, except that they are, uh, they are living on land because they are totally aquatic. Otherwise, they may range in size, they are of type of seaweed, and they are photosynthetic as well. Which is a false statement out of the given options, slime molds and outer molds, they are protists. Yes, it is a true statement. There are flagellated algae and flagellated protozoans. Yes, it is a true statement. Um, pro among protists, some flagellates are photosynthetic. Flagellates, they may be some sort of algae as well. But among protists, only green algae ever have a sexual life cycle is a wrong statement. There are other examples as well, having sexual life cycle as well. Coral reefs, they're formed due to dead corals as well as red algae. So right option is delta. And late blight of potatoes is caused by phytophthora infestans. One of the following is a unicellular non-motile protozoa that is plasmodium. So Charlie is the right option. That was all about a protist or certain important questions about protest. I hope so it will be helpful for you. Thank you so much.